everyone, I hope you're all okay and I hope you've had a lovely morning. Today's story is called Owl Babies. <clears throat> Once there were three baby owls, Sarah and Percy and Bill. They lived in a hole in the trunk of a tree with their owl mother. The hole had twigs and leaves and owl feathers in it. It was their house. One night, they woke up and their owl mother was gone. Where's Mummy? asked Sarah. Oh my goodness, said Percy. I want my Mummy, says Bill. The baby owls thought, all owls think a lot. I think she's gone hunting, said Sarah. To get us our food, said Percy. I want my mummy, says Bill. But their owl mother didn't come. The baby owls came out of their house and they sat on the tree and waited. A big branch for Sarah a small branch for Percy and an old bit of ivy for Bill. She'll be back, said Sarah. Back soon, said Percy. I want my mummy, says Bill. It was dark in the wood and they had to be brave for things moved all around them. She'll bring us mice and things that are nice, said Sarah. I suppose so, said Percy. I want my mummy, said Bill. They sat and they thought. All owls think a lot. Sit on my branch, said Sarah, and they all did, all three together. Suppose she got lost, said Sarah. Or a fox got her, said Percy. <laughs> I want my mummy, says Bill. And the baby owls closed their owl eyes and wished their owl mother would come. That's a bit frightening, isn't it? And, look, she came. Soft and silent, she swooped through the trees to Sarah, Percy and Bill. You see Mummy coming to them? Mummy, cried, they cried and they flapped. And they dance and they bounce up and down on their branch. They're so happy to see Mummy. What's all the fuss? Their owl mother said. You knew I'd come back. The baby owls thought. I'll think a lot. I knew it, said Sarah. And I knew it, said Percy. I love my Mummy, said Bill. Look at that. They're all so happy. Now, really they shouldn't have gone out, they should have just stayed inside, shouldn't they? But their mummy came back and they're all very happy and they're safe now. I hope you all have a lovely afternoon and I'll see you again for another story. Bye for now.